Wait, is that is that eyes I see behind the door? I think that's eyes. Uh oh. I maybe shouldn't have tried to open the door. Don't open the door. No. Don't no no no. That was okay. That's a mistake. That's. Hello and welcome back to Ruby Quest uh, Undertow. We're going to where we left off. Or actually, sorry. Let's say Ruby Quest Undertow the demo. We're going to where we left off of solving the computer puzzle, and I guess just going to the Z13, if I recall. Z13. Z13 door. Though what we have in our inventory, let me just remind myself. Just two things. Circle panel key I haven't used yet. I think we'll probably have to grab a few things on our way, maybe. Wait. What is this? What? What's she doing? Can I not go that way? Also, why is there a hair on my fucking eye? Seriously? Ugh. <sighs> Alright, I think... I think I got it out. No, but what the fuck is she... What, what is it? What's going on here with the, the two hands on the door? Oh, wait. C's open doors? Hold on, what am... What does Z do? What... what what am I doing? I forgot Spacebar was the action key for a second there, but I was like stuck thinking, like, what the fuck am I doing? What is Z when at a door? Yeah, maybe it's a mechanic that isn't in use right now. Like, am I holding it steady from something trying to break its way in, maybe? Kind of interesting. Let's pick up the gloves, though. I don't know what I'm going to need to bring with me, but I want to at least make sure maybe I have the right things. Oh, let's go with the gloves, fuck it. What are we going to gain from here? Oh, hey, did you open that shutter just now? Yes, I'm smart. I believe I did. Well, if you're going to in there, just be careful and don't leave me here, okay? Well, of course I won't. I'm still trying to find a way to get rid of these bars. Oh, okay, um, thanks. Yeah. Don't leave without me. You're, you're sort of behind fucking bars, you know? You know, sorta. Of. I'm just gonna. Just gonna crawl in the. Oh, fence to. This questionable room. Let's unlock this. And yes. Led to the door I presumed it would. The autopsy room, I do believe. It's some kind of metal table. There's large, bloody cloth draped over it. Ah, uh, well, it just depends on who was on this table. Was it me, was it Tom, or something else? Some kind of metal table. There's a large bloody cloth draped over it. I guess we can check the computer. Looks like it's working, except there's no mouse. Am I supposed to find a mouse so I can make it work? I don't think we need a mouse. There are a bunch of notes and some photos pinned on this billboard. These photos look pretty gruesome. I guess we'll be looking at that. Now let's do that, I guess. Documents, documents. Disturbing photos. March 7th, 9th, and 13th. It's like some kind of weird blood clotting or... organ or muscle tissue redevelopment on a bone or femur or like... something like that. Photographs that were pinned onto billboards, some notes attached above the photos read as follows. Number one, brought in heavy lacerations and dismemberment, no chance of survival from grievous injuries. Noticing strange movement along bone, strange fleshy growths suddenly appearing on stumps, stripping away remaining flesh on arm with mild acid bath for further experimentation. Cut arm off from body, flesh stops growing on dismembered arm, but heightened activity on stump attached to main body, growth taking up more complex shape. Fur restoration is also present. Is it reading? The DNA? Where did Red get this sample? Hmm. Personal? Finally I found someone, but unfortunately not under very good circumstances. His name is Tom, and he's trapped in some kind of prison. Maybe if I help him out, we can both find a way out of here. I can't just leave him in there. He also mentioned he was hungry, and if I find some food, uh, maybe he'd make me get a kill you know, at his opus. That just sounds lewd. 
Let me look at your opus. Oh. Something like that, you know? It's a little, it's just a little weird. What is this thing? It electrify me? It's a very strange looking card reader. I don't have a card reader. Wait, is that, is that eyes I see behind the door? I think that's eyes. Uh, oh. I maybe shouldn't have tried to open the door. Don't open the door. No. Don't. No. 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 That was. Okay, that's a mistake. That's. Oh. Combat pose! I. Uh, it's a fucking. Oh, that's gross! Uh, control. The, no. Okay. Uh, okay, we're. Uh, I couldn't. We. Well then. How do I combat? Find keys. Dodge Z. Attack poses. Sh okay. No wait. What about control? Controls ready stance. Shift. So we need to dodge with Z. Block with X. An attack with shift. So it's shift Z and X essentially. Shift Z X. Shift Z X. Okay, didn't want to do that. Okay, this is a. I, I'm hitting the wrong buttons repeatedly. Yes. No? Okay. This is really gross. I'm a little bit low on the health here. And I'm almost dead. It, it's, it's, it's kind of fucking disgusting. Maybe I should have tried talking to it. I'm a little bit curious on what would have happened if I tried to talk to it. I really want to go back, but let's examine it first. Okay, no, I didn't want to go through the fucking door. We do have a lot of bandages, but... I can't believe what I'm seeing right now. What in the world could this thing be? I can see something sticking out of it. I see. I'm gonna... S I'm not even gonna look at the person. Well, let's just let's just reload it. Wait, it auto saved? Oh, it auto saved here. Let me see the dodging mechanics. I'm a little curious on. Oh. Okay, it's not really effective. I keep hitting the wrong button. The so stab back up. Stab. I think I the. I think what I gotta do is just simply stab and run. But it's so awkward, though. Okay. Yeah. It's difficult to fight in this combat system. But okay, let's just go back. Alright, this time. This time, we're gonna grab these disgusting pictures. Alright, what is this now? We're gonna fully investigate the room now. It's some kind of lever sticking out of the wall. Oh. Someone could lose a limb or worse if they were under that. Huh. What if I didn't attack it? I think I get maybe what I can use, do to use the environment against this thing is we just go out the door, we go in a full circle. I mean, my fingers not even what in the full circle, and have it chase me in the vent, and then I'll pull the lever and probably cut like decapitated guillotine style. Let's try to go for that. That'd be pretty cool, and it would mean we don't uh, waste any of the bandages. So let's try going through here. No. Okay, we're gonna need the key card with that. Oh, stop, stop, stop. Oh my god. All right, who's that? Hmm, talk to. 
Hello? Are you alright? That's creepy. Talk to you again. Hello? Alright, let's just let about then. Let's watch the beautiful cutscene again. That was uh, very delicious. Poor Rabbit is like, I don't think I want to open this door. Like, all sludge, like, all of its fur was cut off. And the bones are gone, but everything's still redeveloped of the fleshy muscle and tendon mass. Mm, the bear. Mm. Mm, bear. Oh, jeez. Oh, God. Oh, God. It's just. <laughs> that's disgusting. That's hilarious at the same time. Boom. Ugh. Watch, like, we gotta show it to Tom. <laughs> hey, Tom, you wanna see it? <laughs> He's all like, what the fuck? No. Aww. That was too slow. Oh, jeez. No. Let's do it faster, then. Ah, it's just leaving bloody trails everywhere. That's disgusting. It's like Mr. Hanky the Christmas Pooh on early episodes of South Park. Just the shit went everywhere. Oh, wait, did I lose it? I can actually lose it, I think. Oh, there you are. Come on. I could avoid maybe fighting that at the same time. I highly doubt I'd be able to save it. Tom, you get to see this nightmare fuel again. Here you go, buddy. Yeah, I'm not even going to look at that, Tom says. It's blo Oh, I've left it closed. Oh, no. Uh-oh. No. Disgusting. It's got a hole in its fucking head. I'm not even going to go do a circle. I'm just going to let him crawl through that hole. I'm going to scare Tom and be like, Hey, Tom, check this out. And then I'm going to contain it in there. Ah, oh, he already crawled in? That was a little faster than I expected. Come on. It's... I don't know, I don't think I'll be able to capture the way I'm thinking. Jesus. It's so fast. It's already in! I still want to try to cut its head off, though. I'm not going to give up yet. Hitting S on an object doesn't pause the game. That's another issue. I'm... Okay, we'll do it very fast. S, then enter. No. Seriously. See, like... When hitting enter to, uh, to observe something, it pauses it. But hitting S in... Dang, I'm almost out of stamina. I wonder if I can crawl up the stairs. Alright, one more time. Okay, now we go. It should take a little bit longer. Oh, 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 yes! Hell yeah! Finally, you have to chase him and do as I, as I thought. If you just go in the tunnel back out, it will sort of measure how long it should take for him to go in and out. If you just enter the room on the bottom door where Tom is, it'll take him a little bit extra time before he reaches the vents. So it looked like my theory was right. I you know, chopped off. I can't believe what I'm seeing right now. What in the world could this be? I can see something sticking out. So now we just got, you know, the head. It, it, the card was in his head rather than in the body. Uh, what happens if I undo this? Hey, let's try crawling in it. <laughs> I don't think so. <laughs> this is fucking blood everywhere from the encounters of chasing me. But hey, we didn't take any damage as a result. I mean, sorry, we, we took some damage. Some. Let's see what Tom has to think about that. And see if we can crawl in the vents through this end. Hey, Tom. Button, uh, rattle. Why would I want to rattle? And I wanted to talk to Tom about what we just saw, like what we just witnessed. 
the disgusting mass is on the other end. At least the developers uh, put that detail in there. Let's see if we can use the card on this door. It ate the card. One of the lights turned on. Looks like I have to find two more of these cards. Oh. Well, that was fun while it lasted. Let's see if I can use the card. Wait, it said ate the card. I mean, like, actual eight eight, as in it's gone? It actually did. Oh, well, with that all done, I don't know what I can do now. I really don't know what I need to do next time. I'll just, uh... I'll just keep this thing closed, though. I'll just, yeah. There we go. Anything else in this room I should be aware about? I can see a, Oh, I can see a key hidden well with the blood. Oh. A wooden key? Hmm. I'm going to imagine it's for the fish aquarium. Like it's, you know, a treasure box. It looks like a treasure box. It does have an interesting design. I think that is the hint that it's actually for the aquarium and the other cards should be in there, if anything. Open chest. Yes! Just don't die for some reason. And this treasure chest has another card inside. Yeah, yeah. Turns out I don't have any room to care. Um, why is that? I used the key here and you're saying I couldn't discard the key and then pick up the fucking card? Okay. Um, let's just use, let's just use the, let's just use the bandage. There we go. Now I have room. If it, if it discards the key afterwards, I swear to god. I got the card key. Okay. Wait, that means technically it wouldn't have... Okay, we're gonna jump the key. I don't know, and then we're just gonna save. I think that's a plenty for this episode. We, uh, we dealt with some fun, and we're gonna add to the collection here on the ground. We got, uh... Oh, add to the collection. We got, uh, you know, bandage, um, a necklace, a CD, and then a bunch of leaves on the ground. And then there's more to the north of here. So let's just save this. Let's just, yeah. That was a weird episode, isn't it? Finally shit happened. Real shit happened. Um, I'm not sure what thumbnail of that cutscene I should use, but I'm sure I'll find something interesting and something that I really uh, enjoy. And I hope you enjoyed the thumbnail that I'll have created with that mass of a mess. Probably just the bear's face because it says it all. It's kind of weird. Because the fleshy mass is just a, you know, it just looks like a red, either a red penis or just something else. But either way, we saved the game. I hope you enjoyed this episode and look forward to more. If you enjoyed, please leave a like, comment, hit that subscribe button, give a little subscribe, or hit that bell notification down below for some more videos. Thanks for watching. Until next time.